Hello, you little fuckers. <laughs> it's your big old here. Go looking in for come lesson two. As you can tell, I've not done my fucking hands. Ah, you, did, ah, you knew it. You were like, we're not finished yet. Yeah. He's got something else with his fucking arms. Something else with his fucking arms he's going to pull out. So then again, get in with the green. Ah, ah. Remember, lads? Yes, you've got to be precise and you've got to get the fucking job done. But it is also, you've got approximately five minutes to get your fucking cam on. That's including your cream and your fucking helmet and your bergen, your deer sack and your fucking webbing with all the bits of shit that you find in the natural environment of the battlefield. I don't want to see no punks putting bits of fucking concrete fucking blocks <laughs> on the back of the deer sack. One, that's just mental. That's just extra weight. You've already packing fucking X amount of fucking ammo in that, right? And also, since when do you get concrete blocks in the middle of a fucking desert? That's not natural. Is that natural? Ask yourself, is it natural? No. So when you look at the ground, is that going to be natural in my environment? Dog shit is not natural, so no, I'm not putting it on. You can know, I like to. Makes it smell nice. Combat perfume, mate. Combat perfume. I learned this when I was with the SAS, and I was doing the escape and evasion exercise, and they had the dogs on us. I had to make sure that the dogs wouldn't get me sent. So then I had to roll around for approximately five minutes and cheap shit, get it into the fucking paws, into my armpits, into my balls. Doing that, I use your GPSs? It was hard. Well, I survived because I'm here now to teach it, but called fucking Congo. All over you. All over you. Clear, mate. Look in. The hearts. Big out. Out.